We've got uh, Oscar. What is that? It's a freaking dinosaur machine gun animatronic. That's amazing. And he's got an Uzi in his hand. <laughs> Dude, what is going on? What's going on, guys? It's Omniarch, and today I'm bringing you a brand new video where we got early access to another MMO strategy game called Age of Apes. So the developers of Age of Apes saw my videos on YouTube. They reached out to me and said, hey, do you want to try our game? You want to maybe make some videos about it? You want to see what the game is all about? And I was like, you know what? let's try let's give it a go right let's see if i can take my warrior skills from rise of kingdoms and apply them to the post-apocalyptic future warfare of monkeys trying to go to space i have no idea what's in store for us so let's boot up the game let's just let's just jump right into it and see what this game is all about that's not that far away from now what they're smarter than we are <laughs> no but okay dude okay that sounds like our current government six strong monkeys <laughs> okay he looks jack dude wow is that we <laughs> dude that's a been okay they think it's a banana i get it race to space baby okay okay oh we have this is actually a cutscene. this is like animated okay whoa okay so this is some sort of ninja looking i guess. okay all right so let's see here we've got, okay so i guess we can pick between oh they all have cutscenes. okay let's see Let, let's this is important Cutscenes are important this is one classy looking dude homie I dig it. Yo, he just he just spills the tea, homie. So these are the Wicked Aristocrats with Lord Anton. I, I, don't, I probably didn't pronounce that right. It's simple with these haughty monkeys. It's their way or the highway. If by highway, you mean shotgun. Okay, I don't think anybody means shotgun by that, but, but, but let's just see what the next one is. All right. Ooh, she bad though. Okay. Chaotic Gunners. Jesse Fame. Smart monkeys probably too into their guns though. For them, orders are more like guidelines. Expect mayhem and many bullets. Okay, Let's see the next one. Whoa, okay, dude. Yo, it's Donkey Kong with a it's, <laughs> it's Donkey Kong with a shotgun and a mohawk. Hell yeah. Okay, brutal shooters. This is Junior apparently. He's got the chain on and everything. Yo, he's blinged out. Strong apes but very unsubtle. Would rather shoot first and <laughs> shoot first and ask questions never a problem is only a problem if they can't shoot it hey okay i do i like that i like that and we got another older monkey here wait i thought they said there was no bananas on the planet oh it's not a banana it's a it's a pen so the cold mechanics this is miss helexis inventive probably too inventive like don't leave your tech near them everything is for science especially when said science is the more explosive kind okay and uh let's take a look here this is the last one we haven't seen yet whoa okay he looks like a bandit I feel like a expert bombers sir greg i like it okay nice beard dude and he's got a is that a flash drive what is that these monkeys are into explosions big explosions small explosions more explosions boom explosions okay and then this is the one that we already saw we saw the razor teeth hunters one-eyed eric whoa his other eyes like a okay all right so i guess these are like civilizations right so we got to pick our faction or our horde okay these are different hordes here now each one has two buffs and a nerf so the wicked Arist aristocrats they give you three percent troop health five percent troop load and then you lose three percent action restore um we got three percent hitter defense so i'm assuming hitter is like a troop type uh building speed is increased by three percent and food gathering is decreased by three percent now guys i'm gonna just throw out a tip right now i've played other games like this obviously rise of kingdoms but there, there's others and i'm gonna go ahead and say that whatever buffs and debuffs that you get from these troops and on these hordes specifically it's so small it's so minor that it probably doesn't have a major impact on your gameplay until way later so 
if you're gonna play this game just pick whichever one you like the most we're gonna try and, and put a little bit of, a little bit of thought behind it but i don't want to overthink this so the shooters get five percent shooter attack an extra five thousand hospital capacity and you lose three percent energy restore okay uh we get uh five percent pilot defense uh five percent research speed which is nice and lose three percent healing speed that's so that's not good for pvp uh we get wall breaker attack plus six percent okay we get five percent training speed and you lose two percent iron gathering speed and finally uh ten percent pve damage okay uh we get five percent action uh action point restoration but you lose three percent march speed i like march speed he actually looked really fast how did he how does he lose march speed what now it looks like there's a star by this one and apparently the only difference is this little box right here and this says you get 200 shiny cds which i'm going to assume is the premium currency in this game uh so i guess this is kind of like an incentive to balance out the different hordes right so that way not everybody will just pick one uh and so you know by by randomizing which one gets this extra bonus currency i'm assuming that was like the intent so that way it's kind of balanced on on every server uh, because unlike rise of kingdoms i believe that the horde that you pick actually influences uh who you can or who you're gonna team up with and fight against in in like the pvp scenario so i think having this balanced is actually important so that's probably why they went ahead and did that all right i think i'm gonna go with the wicked aristocrats because i like the troop health and i like the extra load here i think in the early game this is going to be pretty important but we do lose a little bit of action point but that's okay because you know i lose a lot of action points through just inefficiency and time play so it should be okay let's go ahead and start up the game salutations young one the wicked aristocrats will teach you the philosophy of surviving you will achieve great things here i sure hope so teamwork helps us launch rockets and dominate all the other monkeys now let's enjoy the beautiful launch of our rocket let's do it baby there's an emergency we need more energy for our rocket okay every problem has a solution if you're if our uranium is not enough then we should gather more so we're launching rockets with uranium okay you look like a special monkey but everyone here needs an assistant to make our lives easier um so this looks like uh uranium 18,000. that's a lot of your okay um let's go ahead and march over and grab that thing then oh they got bicycles look at that he looks like a pirate with his one eye okay so we grab the uranium instantaneously we fill up our purple purple rocket yo we're going to the moon baby let's go i mean the uh the banana in the sky well done monkey keep getting more uranium and maybe i'll allow you to press our rocket's launch button oh i get to press it anyway i'm just thinking about that meme of the guy sweating he doesn't know which button to press anyway all right let's go ahead and press it. let's do it baby let's launch that rocket does that mean we're gonna start in space what is happening here look at the green coming out of it oh my god oh okay holy that were there people in there are monkeys were there monkeys in there rest in peace monkeys what bananas what bananas happened to our rocket we only have one we must find it and try our best to repair it okay so i think we've got our first mission here oh there's my city there we go i must go now and organize the search party you're in charge of the city uh let's go back to our city and let's see don't worry if someone is here to help you that's me i'm roger your faithful assistant cool all right roger let's get it going very few monkeys are given such an important task on their first day that's why you must be the first one to find our rocket the rocket crashed into an area covered in fog but if we go in we'll never find our way back luckily our scout monkeys can help us explore and uncover all that fog how lucky for us but first you'll need to build a watchtower to accommodate them task system unlocked okay we got our first task baby let's build this watchtower let's click that let's put it down all right there he is look at him with his little like propeller what can i look for uh what can i look for you boss some treasure chests white mutants maybe some females hmm, some females eh uh we're gamers we don't talk to females okay uh, uh don't listen to this monkey just send him into the fog to search for our rocket just just enough with the distractions pal we gotta find our freaking our destroyed rocket okay we can find the crash site along this way we have to hurry this is important there could have been monkeys on that thing so let's send him over there we'll see we'll unclear the fog i love the art style of this game let me just pause for a second i love the art style i feel like we're in like some sort of like tropical jungle which is just i love that like I, that's why i loved pokemon sun and moon it was this very tropical that was more hawaiian than like rainforest type of this but uh, same sort of feeling i'm getting in terms of like i just love that tropical vibe um i found some metal pieces here okay it looks like our scout monkey found a rocket wreckage keep looking maybe there's other pieces nearby Alrighty, let's do it let's go ahead and scout this thing over here let's see what we find in the wreckage i'm gonna turn the volume up a little bit in case you guys can't hear it at all 
maybe we can find other important parts so he looks like he found something i don't really know what that's for but let's go ahead and keep searching let's send him out there we got more stuff oh, there's billboards nice here oh no look at that a rocket is now just a big piece of junk let's see if we can manage to save something useful out of it okay it might have been a piece of junk before seeing as how it exploded on the first launch but hey it's more of a piece of junk now so uh there we go we found another uh little gear thing i don't know what that does but what is going on are those yetis dude what is that what it's getting dangerous here we need to retreat now okay yeah i mean sh okay uh you are here to die monkeys we'll enjoy having you as our dinner what is this what is this like he's got green eyes we can't survive this we need to help we need the help of a fighter to take our rocket out of here okay all right let's go back to the city uh fighters like to show their power and skills in battle if we want to recruit some you need to build the arena first okay so i think we're going to uh we're gonna build this arena i think this is how we can like uh summon like uh like i guess leaders or commanders or whatever um they enjoy the sound of applause and if they like you maybe they'll consider joining your cause that rhymed all right let's go ahead and uh a fighter wants to meet me cool all right let's go ahead and see what we got here and who is this guy nice here's fuscata one of our best fighters that's a big blade dude you you cool with that okay okay dude all right i see you he joins your base to lead your troops and fight under your command if you're the leader of this city i'd love to live here then nice thanks man I, I i appreciate that a fighter at this at the right time i like that we need someone who can help us fight off the white mutants okay so we've got the antagonists here white mutants you said a piece of cake give me some troops and i'll bring your rocket back look at him he's like ain't nothing gonna stop me all right let's do it let's uh let's train 30 pilots all right let's send them over there level one pilots so it looks like they move and shoot fast they can use this to their advantage against shooters but can't do much against hitters so it looks like pilots beat shooters hitters beat pilots and shooters beat hitters that seems to be the way that it goes anyway they're riding bikes they got sunglasses they got the vest and they're just driving around the racetrack like absolute savages that's amazing oh hey hey yo he's got the club and everything i love it dude hurry up the white mutants can destroy our rocket at any time okay we're, we're enjoying the scenery and the cutscenes. okay wait a second seems like our rocket's pretty far i'm feeling pretty lazy today so let's move our city closer to save us some time I, I'm, I'm with you there dude i'm right there with you let's uh let's go ahead and teleport our city over here uh it's gonna use some energy apparently let's do that Ooh, yo we used a we used that instant transmission we just like phew. great now that we're close to it we can finally take it back all right let's fight these uh white mutants oh they're just coming right to us we're waiting for you monkeys your time has come haha <laughs> girl white mutants hurry send your troops to fight them or they'll eat us alive let's do it let's uh let's attack them let's go ahead and uh listen to my instructions follow me we'll march with fuscata baby and our troops are purple that's cool i like that look at that big sword dude that sword is bigger than the freaking monkeys that are behind him all right our fighter and our troops will handle them this is our chance take the rocket and let's get out of here all right uh oh there's more all right let's attack them too let's let's just get let's just get it done okay let's just get it done i love the blade man he's like uh he's like zabuza homie he's just like um are we gonna win this yeah we're gonna win this right all right cool all right we got the w baby we got the w uh let's take back this rocket this is uh oh whoa what's that dude yo oh nah 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 chief okay why didn't they send reinforcements before what's this what are all these monkeys come out don't think this is the end we'll come back for you okay so we teleported to safely uh, safety apparently i don't really understand i mean i guess i guess there was like a lot of them right uh we were gonna get swarmed day one now it's time to develop this zoo you call city in this area you can find resources that will help you upgrade your city follow the task and develop your city and your power yeah i got it okay all right so now we're getting into the good stuff we're getting into the game it looks like the tutorial was pretty much uh pretty much over um so let's see here we can uh we can zoom all the way out we've got a peace shield that looks like there i am oh whoa okay looks like the launch pad is at the middle we've got the brutal shooters chaotic gunners uh, we must develop our city as quickly as possible to transport our rockets to the launch pad before the other hordes do not attack okay it looks like other players are in the server already i don't even know what server this is first things first we gotta claim the name baby we gotta claim the name we we will do it can we do that this will uh yeah do i have one? Oh, they gave you one for free okay cool and that was a quest nice all right can we change this too 
Oh, I like this guy. Oh, but we should we do food? No, no, no. We got to do this guy. I like that. Okay, so we get a bunch of resources for the avatar and the name. I like that. That's free stuff. Okay, first thing we got to do. Let's up. Oh, we got to do the city hall. All right, we'll do the city hall. First thing takes two seconds. I love that. Let's let's do the two second thing. Uh, we got to explore some stuff. Apparently, can we just send a scout? Is that it? Oh, there he is. All right, we're good. Scout is out here. He's doing his thing. Let's uh, let's claim all right that's what we do we got 50 cds cool we got some speed up some resources i'll take all that stuff i love it oh welcome to the arena the number one place to find the best fighters around here in time for a duel by attending duels you have a chance okay we get free stuff and we love free stuff around here so let's press the button let's see who we get to summon baby or if it's just a. Uh... oh hey we did get somebody all right looks like uh scott very popular growing up the type of handsome primate nice all right so let's see we can't look at his skills here he's got a hamburger so i'm already digging it i'm, I'm a fan I received Scott. These duels are awesome. Powerful fighters are here, so come regularly. Okay. We will be sure to do that. Looks like we get a, a free... Another free one here. I don't know what this is. If this is going to be... Okay, we got some universal speed ups. We'll take those. Let's use another ticket just to see what we get. Like, why not, right? We got to get all the free stuff we can right at the beginning. And we got a Fuscata medal. I'm assuming that's going to be used for skill upgrades, potentially. So we get uh, another another frame. Nice. All right. We don't need to worry about that. It's nighttime. It's nighttime. I'm digging it. Oh, we got to turn the graphics up. All right. So we've got, we've got a lot to do. Let's talk to these people here. I don't know... This looks like a tavern. Oh, it is. okay. Welcome to Tavern. It's a cool place to chill and have fun. Here's a joke. Where should a monkey go when he loses his tail? To a retailer. Ha! Gaddy, isn't it funny? Here's a little something for you. Cool. Thanks for the CDs, pal. I appreciate it. Uh, who's this handsome looking, handsome looking fella over here? We got some free stuff. We got 20,000 food, it looks like. Some speed ups. I'll take it. And uh, we get some weekly rewards. Okay. We'll take Saturday the 25th. I'll take the free... 200 cds i love that all right there's some news over there we're ignoring that because we've got stuff to do you guys we're behind okay there's other people on the server already and i don't know which server we're on but there's stuff happening we have a builder and he's not doing anything that you need to optimize okay uh we have to develop a city we got to win the race we need to use speed up so he wants us to use a speed up we'll use a one minute building speed up why not right uh, why not we we got to free up the uh, the builder anyway, so we got to do that Let's build the hitters camp. So this is gonna be another looks like another uh, Another heavy unit. So let's upgrade that right away. Um, we're gonna upgrade the pilot camp to uh, Eight seconds easy peasy. Let's take a look while we're waiting for those eight seconds These are the the commanders that we have now. Um, they're probably not called. Oh, they're called fighters Sorry, they're called fighters in this game. I have to uh, I got to I gotta adjust okay there's different terminology here oh we got another player over here wow the grab this is actually really smooth for an early access game I'm, I'm genuinely impressed um what is that your you surface apes just like humans you go to sky pathetic the uranium is ours you can't have it our uranium the white horde okay so that looks like an event that's a white bruiser okay yeah i'm cool man we're gonna leave him right alone we're just uh we're just doing gr fine without interacting with that fellow so let's see here we got to build the warehouse so we'll build that next i suppose the warehouse is how we protect our resources so let's do that two second upgrade because it makes me feel good and these um we're going to let's just start training stuff right that's 11 minutes we'll just start training stuff while we uh while we get to work i want to move some stuff around here actually you know what no we're gonna we're gonna leave it let's upgrade the warehouse eight seconds is fine it'll give us time to collect some of this stuff here oh 50 fog area okay one chest from the tavern defense walls okay let's upgrade that as well we can do that let's move the warehouse uh we'll move the warehouse over here it's uh to my knowledge i don't think i don't think the layout of the city matters but i could be wrong i'll definitely let you guys know if that's oh we're getting a lot of stuff over here okay all right let's let's explore oh he's still exploring he's still exploring hang on we gotta upgrade that watchtower because we need to start exploring more than one thing at a time all right this is we're oh we're not efficient here we're not efficient we gotta upgrade everything as soon as we can and uh we'll, we'll just get it done okay we'll get it done we're gonna upgrade the defense towers again let's see what we have over here watchtower level two and three um we gotta send out more fog exploration so let's have him do that honestly i should probably just send him out really far away so that way he just keeps looking for stuff 
um, but I want to upgrade kind of everything right now real quick just to get like a, a set of foundation for my city okay we, we need to kind of upgrade everything a little bit looks like we have a free ticket so let's go ahead and uh, open this up see what we get maybe it's uh, some more sculptures no it's a 30 minutes of building speed ups we are gonna need those desperately without a doubt so this looks like some missions and we can potentially get a random epic fighter okay i'll take that man i love that we gotta log in for eight days and we get a free epic so that's good i like free stuff right i mean like let's be honest we're, we're free to play right now okay we're living that free to play life it's been a while since i've been free to play so um at the moment we're living that life looks like we got some decorations over here i like that a mini rocket a dead monkey we don't like those we don't we want them alive okay let's upgrade the arena we'll see uh cool down time of free we like more free is better for me um explore 100 fog defeat white mutants this is uh, the time to shine baby there they are they're not even white they're like glowing or maybe they're white in the daytime and like glow in the dark at nighttime let's uh let's create a unit here we're gonna use uh just whatever we can basically and uh you know what 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 are, what are wall breakers i don't even know what that is but let's just let's just not I, don't, I feel like this isn't a wall right so why would we send wall breakers to it that's just my logic there um it looks like we're dealing bigger numbers than they're dealing to us which is always a good sign in an rpg that that is good clean the map okay we, we're cleaning the map baby i like this uh we have 2000 power we have our warehouse to three we need to do the walls next okay we're, we're doing the walls baby man this feels good this feels good because it's been so long since i started like in rise of kingdoms that was so long ago and honestly you know rise of kingdoms i love the game sometimes there's downtime right and that's not even the fault of the developers there's just there's just sometimes there's downtime it's just that's just how it is for every single game out there and so this game might actually be a fun game to play when there's downtime there right so maybe we have we play this and then we have you know rise of kingdoms as well they can live in harmony and i love it and uh i think if if, if you guys like rise of kingdoms you're probably gonna like this because it's the same same gameplay style right um it's just a totally different theme and i think that's cool and i think it also mixes it up a little bit it's not a it's not a carbon copy although a lot of things are very similar now let's see this is our daily quests we're gonna need whatever this projector module is it looks like that's important because you get one at the end here too which means they're probably good so uh let's get our free thing here we got a ticket for the heroes or whatever it is let's go ahead and see what we get here we got 5,000 experience for our fighters. That's cool. I will take it. Um, we have someone in the hospital. Let's heal the hospital. It should take zero time. Nice. Um, let's see here. We get our daily refreshment. It looks like every couple minutes, every five minutes, you can talk to him, I guess, and you get some free stuff. And we like free stuff. We we talked about this. Um, we got some mail. Uh, these are the battle reports and a subway entrance. Okay. Uh, we should go we should go explore that subway entrance. I think you're right. Wow That looks like New York City subway entrances just glowing green and really dank and probably smell terrible I love it. All right the tavern. Let's upgrade the tavern I don't know what upgrading the tavern even would do but let's do it because we can okay we're gonna do it because we can uh what's this um tavern level two? Oh my god dude there's just so we have so much to do i love how the city hall looks it looks like a freaking it looks like a a, a tree house in a freaking in a jungle that i wish i had as a kid um uh who likes to wait let's speed it up again okay let's like you're listen it's your world i'm just living in it cool seems you know how to speed up you have lots of speed ups in your bag don't refrain from using them listen smart players no that's we oh well okay an alliance i'll take i'll join an alliance let's do it baby let's do it i'm ready we got 50 members hopefully they're online right now smart players no don't use your speed ups okay don't use them right away we're gonna save them for the important upgrades but the tutorial wants us to use it we'll use it just for the sake of the video but if you guys are choosing to play this game again link in the description don't waste your speed ups and silly stuff right you want to use it on the on the troop training buildings obviously you want to use it for research and things like that okay there's gonna be some research we already know it so there it is the research lab i knew it i knew it we saw it in the uh in, when we were picking a horde we saw research speed i knew it was a thing so let's go ahead and build that research lab the sooner we get this done the better let's move it i don't like it right there let's move it uh we'll move it actually we're gonna probably put another another troop training thing over there. let's move the research lab right up front upgrade it right away because oh i just used a second builder i didn't even realize what am i still building oh this still is going okay all right well whatever we got two builders now so like let's let's get it um let's let's use these tickets i want to see what we can get here
a 15 build building speed up 15 minute building speed up sorry and what else are we getting what is this this is a 50,000 iron all right we're gonna need that okay we're gonna need it i'm sure let's keep upgrading the watchtower because honestly like we need to start sending more than one freaking guy out there to explore all that fog there's a lot of fog a lot of stuff to do and uh we don't we only have one guy looking through it all so we got to figure that out we got to get better at that um research iron level one okay let's see what we can do with iron level one um now i know in rise of kingdoms if you visit the villages on the map you can get these for free but it only costs a hundred of each and it takes five seconds so like do like do we really have to optimize that much i, I don't think so oh we got a little flag here oh, we can change the flag okay uh let's go with uh oh yo i like oh this is dope wait which one is better though oh you need to get an achievement i don't have that okay well i like this guy with the uh with the ak 47 it's a golden ak man that's super baller let's do that um we got to defeat more white mutants and we got a daily quest so give me that i like it we got another free ticket what is this let's fight the mutants um oh we're doing another oh wait our dude is still out where is he there he is let's go uh let's go see what he can do let's just walk around what is this supermarket oh you gather food from supermarkets that's so funny and we're right next to a player what's good man what's good i still got my bubble on don't hit me yet all right chief listen listen we're killing the white mutants you can come inside now i didn't realize you were sitting out in the cold okay i feel bad now just come on in eat some food out of a can or whatever it is let's heal up the troops and we'll be on our way all right let's send uh let's send some more scouts out here i suppose what did we get from the subway we got a bunch of food and a, and a ticket so hey i'll take it it's free stuff uh oh we got 200 cds for joining an alliance so there's a little pro tip for you guys if you want some premium currency for free make sure you go ahead and join an alliance and of course you know they're going to be useful for you you're going to want some allies when you're out here in a post-apocalyptic monkey jungle okay you want as many friends as you can get so let's upgrade the warehouse that looks like it's going to take a minute which is unfortunate we could speed it up but i think we're going to chill for now we have a second hospital already which is cool what did we get over here we can upgrade a talent so he leveled up so these are the talent trees we have what is this um this is wait does it tell us this is speed hunt and hitter so speed is probably like mobility hitter is obviously a, a unit specific tree and hunt what is this this fighter excels at fighting mutants so that's like a pve so like a peacekeeper so uh okay well um excellent speed and marches quickly interesting okay well he's kind of our only fighter right now so i don't want to build him for march speed let's build him this way let's build him for hitters we probably actually want a peacekeeper now that i think about it we're gonna want him to to fight mutants mostly and the first one's moving speed let's just put a point in that because hey we're gonna need movement speed no matter what we do with this guy uh and how do we upgrade skills can we do that what's his first skill actually wait enter a deep meditation and summon a lightning bolt that strikes down your enemies dealing damage with a damage factor of 100 goes up to 500 doesn't seem that great to me but we don't know how we don't know what the baseline is right that could be really good in this game uh and stun your enemies into submission for two seconds or two turns sorry <clears throat> wow so we get a two turn stun that's pretty cool man that's pretty cool not that much damage it seems like I don't know and it looks like these are some of the legendaries maybe so we've got lewis armstrong okay oh look at the hair whoa dude calm down pal okay chill out all right chief maximus what is that dude what is that that is amazing his damage factor is 1400 and he has a 20 percent chance uh 20 chance of hitting twice that's amazing okay we got laurent laurent is just uh that k kona looking looking hillbilly with the biggest shotgun i've ever seen in my life flowers of life he has a healing factor that's pretty cool okay we've got uh oscar what is that it's a freaking dinosaur machine gun animatronic that's amazing and he's got an uzi in his hand <laughs> dude what is going on the dragon's head opens spraying flames out in a fan-shaped area this attack causes burn damage for three seconds so 800 damage factor and then 300 damage factor over time dude i love that that's so cool and then we have tiny yo that's diva baby we already know that's diva don't even front that is diva from overwatch sugar overdose shoot multiple candy missiles to enemy troops causing massive damage factor of 1300 and stopping attacks for two seconds what what yo these these look crazy cool 
these are crazy cool maverick is on a freaking jetpack okay we got koru topi that's a literal ninja this reminds me of the ninja monkey from time splitters if you guys have played that game you're a real one you better press that like button man mike just has dual wielding pistols yo homie is in the side of the neighborhood that you're not trying to go to and he'll remind you why you won't okay bruce isn't messing around bruce is not messing around and who's this we got rodriguez just doing his work man he's just he's just doing tunnels homie is jacked he's got a freaking drill for an arm all right i see you man i see you so it looks like we got mostly legendaries epics and then the only uh the only like elite level ones are just the two that we have so hey the more of these we can get the better so let's work on that guys i think that's gonna do it for this episode i'm gonna be playing this game more on the channel so you can look forward to that again this game is going to be going global international it's gonna be coming to the ios app store very very soon like within the next couple of days i believe so if you if you guys want to get in early if you want to start powering up before the rest of the world even knows about this game like this game it's, it's gonna be big the developers have other very large uh game titles on the mobile app stores so this game is going to have a lot of players right off the bat and if you guys want a chance to get in early use the link in the description below if you guys want to play with me i am in server 1102 omicron i think that's how you pronounce it so if you guys get a chance if you download the game make sure you join my server so we can start smashing a brand new game together again if you like rise of kingdoms i think you're gonna like this game and of course you can count on me to try to cover everything we can try to do uh, fighter guides and different things to teach you guys a bit more about this game how it's different from rise of kingdoms and just for new players in general like how to be good at the game so make sure you guys like the video if you enjoyed it subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos of age of apes i'm actually really excited to play this game i'm not even kidding like i'm excited to have that new player experience again and it's just a refreshing art style a refreshing theme comment down below if you have any questions about this game if you're having trouble running it on like your emulator for blue stacks or something like that i'll try to answer everything that i possibly can i do obviously have uh, a way to contact the developers directly so if you guys have any questions i can kind of forward them over to those guys and we can try and figure this game out together as always my social media links are in the description below so make sure you go and follow me on instagram and twitter make sure you follow me also on twitch and join my discord we might have to start building a community of age of apes over there as well but i'm not going to get ahead of myself yet right well, well we'll take this one step at a time okay i want to make sure you guys like this game as much as i do and as always there's a link in the description below to download rise of kingdoms for your computer that link will also let you download blue stacks which is how i am playing age of apes right now it's my favorite emulator later and once i changed the device profile here to the one plus five i think it was uh this game ran flawlessly it looks beautiful on my computer so make sure you try out blue stacks in the link in the description with that being said guys thank you so much for watching this has been omniarch i will talk to you guys again soon peace